When you look at the sea, you're looking at a vast mystery. In 1992, a top secret program of the US Navy discovered a mysterious sound in the Pacific at a frequency of 52 hertz. A solitary whale broadcasting at a frequency that no other whale could understand. When I heard this story, the hairs on my arm just stood up. And as it turns out, it wasn't just me. Legend has it that 52 has been roaming the ocean for decades, entirely alone. 52 Hertz has been nicknamed the loneliest whale in the world. It's an amazing tale. The idea that there's a species of whale making a sound that no one has ever heard before. So I was going through some of our recordings mm -hmm. and we found it. So it's still alive. Yep, it's out there. One whale, but it's a big ocean. By the 1960s, almost all the large whales were gone. And this all began to change after a young biologist started listening to the song of the humpback whale. It became a multi-platinum record. The world realized they sing. It made people care. And when people care, they can change the world. To find the 52 Hertz whale, we have a bioacoustic team, real-time listening. So when we hear the 52 hertz sound, we can say, let's go over and investigate. The sounds of fin and blue whales could travel about 13,000 miles. This is a long-range social network. 60 years ago, ship noise didn't exist. Today, when we think of all the shipping traffic, imagine you're a whale. It drowns out everything you could possibly be listening to. Bridge, do we have a go-ahead to deploy? Two the boat prepared to launch drone. Drone in the air. We should be going after all great mysteries like this. There's another one just behind it, John. We are social beings. Stop, boat! Over here, over here! The greatest joy is actually in the connectivity with life. They're going for it, this is it. After years of endless searching, what was that? after years of calling out, it was the uniqueness of 52's call that just may lead us right to him.